Hi there, my name is Tom. Today we will be talking about adding fractions with different denominators. Adding fractions with common denominators is easy. We simply add the numerators while using the same denominator. But what if we have different denominators? Jane has recently acquired two adjoining lots with frontages of 131 and 1 3rd feet and 85 and 3 quarters feet. She needs to know the frontages of both lots. Let's help her out. We need to get the sum of two fractions, 131 and 1 3rd and 85 and 3 quarters. You will notice that because the denominators are different, you can't simply add the numerators to get your answer. We have to convert the fractions so their denominators are all the same. To do that, we need to find the least common denominator or LCD between the two fractions. What is the LCD between 3 and 4? Let's find out. Let's start by writing down the multiples of 3. 3 times 1 equals 3, 3 times 2 equals 6, 3 times 3 equals 9, and 3 times 4 equals 12. Now let's try to do the same for the number 4. 4 times 1 equals 4, 4 times 2 equals 8, 4 times 3 equals 12, and 4 times 4 equals 16. Now that we have their multiples written down, it's easier to see that our LCD is 12. Here's a rule about fractions. Multiplying the numerator and the denominator by the same number will not change the value of the fraction. Now that we have an LCD of 12, let's continue to add up our fractions. To get 12, we need to multiply 3 by 4. This means we also have to multiply the numerator by 4. Now we have 131 and 4 twelfths. 4 times 3 equals 12. This means we also need to multiply a numerator by 3 to get 9. Our second fraction is now 85 and 9 twelfths. Now that we have the same denominator, let's add our fractions. 131 plus 85, that's 216. Then we just add our numerators, 4 plus 9 is 13. You'll notice our answer contains an improper fraction. We must change it to a proper fraction to get to our final answer. Let's simplify our previous answer of 216 and 13 twelfths. How many twelfths are there in 13? 1. And we have 12 as our denominator. For our numerator, 13 minus 12 is 1. Our final answer is 217 and 1 twelfth. Now, Jane knows that the total frontage of both lots is 217 and 112 feet. Remember these basic steps when adding fractions with different denominators. Start by finding the least common denominator and convert the fractions so the denominators are all the same. Next, you can add up the numerators while using the same denominator. And lastly, always express your answers in their simplest forms. Now you know how to add fractions with different denominators. Thanks for watching!